Hi, my name is Kip Sigmund and I'm a consultant with TypeSafe and I'm going to show you how to quickly develop a RESTful web service with the Play Framework and Scala using TypeSafe Activator. I've already started Activator and I'm going to use a template I've already loaded called Just Play Scala. This will provide me with a bare bones Play and Scala project. This project provides one demo controller called application, so I'm just going to do all my work in here. And what I'd like to do is create a RESTful web service that'll serve a list of entities in JSON format. So the first thing I'm going to do is import the play JSON library. Okay. Now I've previously created a data model. I'm just going to paste that in. And this consists of an entity called place, which is pretty simple with a couple properties. I've provided some mock data. And this line 16 is a JSON rights converter that knows how to convert the place entity into a JSON object. If you'd like to learn more about rights converter, it's covered extensively in the play documentation under the working with JSON section. I'll create a action here. I'll just call it list places. I'll start with just a skeleton. Now I'd like to get a JSON representation of that list of places. So the JSON library provides me with utility object that'll help me do that. Now if you actually looked at the API signature for this, it takes a second argument which is an implicit rights converter. And because I have that in scope, that'll get automatically used. And then I'll pass my JSON representation as the body of the action result. The framework should take care of the rest as far as formatting the data and setting the correct headers when it serves the response. The last thing I need to do is create a route for my service and bind it to the controller action I just created. I'm going to have this respond to a path of places. Point that to the correct controller action. And that should be it. I'll now run the app. And I'll open it in another browser tab. This takes just a second to compile. There we go. Now I'll run my path. And there we go. It looks like uh, my list of places is being served in the JSON format. I'd also like to check the headers, and I could do that with the browser plugin, but I'm just going to use the command line utility curl. That dash i flag just tells it to include headers. And double checking that, looks like the HTTP status is correct and the content type is also correct. So we're done. Now obviously I covered a lot of concepts in a very short period of time, but if you'd like to learn more, get TypeSafe Activator and I've identified a couple templates that can help you get started with RESTful Web Services. Or you can look at the Play Framework documentation. I've also identified a couple specific pages that cover creating RESTful web services. If you can't find what you're looking for in either of those locations, you can contact me directly and I can point you in the right direction. Thank you.